Hi everybody, my name is Joshua Jensen and I'm here to discuss with you buying down your interest rate and paying points on your refinance. Now, refinancing, whether you're dropping your interest rate to save money monthly, whether you're getting cash out to maybe pay off some debt or do some home improvements, buying down your interest rate is a very, very intense process. You have phrases that you may not be familiar with, DTI or debt to income, loan to value, appraisal waivers, mortgage insurance, and most importantly, points. Now, talking with friends, talking with family, moms, dads, uncles, grandmas, they may have talked to you and told you, do not buy points, it's not worth it, it's just the bank getting more money. They are right on the last point. Buying points increases your loan amount, and it gives you the ability to get a lower interest rate. Discount points or points, what they're commonly known as, is a percentage of the loan amount that's added into the loan. So it's part of the money, or it's part of the loan amount, that's increased based on how many points you get. For example, if you have a $200,000 mortgage and you buy one discount point or buy one point, that's going to equal $2,000. A point is a percent of your loan amount. Now, there are several reasons why people may say don't buy points. It increases your loan amount. It's not worth it. I disagree. Here are reasons that you will want to buy points. Number one, you get a lower interest rate. The more, point, the more you spend up front, the lower your interest rate is going to be. Number two, by getting a lower interest rate, you're going to have a lower mortgage payment. Number three, you're also going to give the money, the mortgage company, less money every single month in interest. And then, one of the last reasons to buy points is the ability to pay your home off faster. Now, we're going to go over each of these examples. Lower interest rate number one. That is the primary goal of buying down your rate or by paying points. You lower your interest rate. The more you pay in points, the lower your interest rate is going to get. Lowering your monthly payment. Because you've spent money up front to lower your interest rate, you are now going to spend less money every single month. In this, lo in this loan scenario that we're going to discuss over the next, I next couple slides is based on a $250,000 loan amount. Option number one. Interest rate at 2.5%, you've paid two points or $5,000 to get that interest rate to 2.5%. Your loan amount now, instead of $250,000, is $255,000. Your payment is $1,007, and the money you give to the bank is $530. Now, let's compare that to not buying the interest rate down. Interest rate instead of 2.5% is 3.25. You don't pay any points, so your loan amount stays at 250,000. However, your mortgage payment jumps up to $1,088 a month, and your interest that you give the mortgage company every single month jumps up $150. Reason number one, lower your payment. You pay less in interest. By buying that interest rate down, and by spending that additional $5,000 up front, you are going to save a significant amount of interest over the life of the loan. In five years, you're going to give the mortgage company $30,000, $56,000 in 10 years, almost $94,000 in 20 years, and then you're going to give the mortgage company $107,000 just as a thank you for giving them the loan. That seems like a lot of money. However, that $5,000 that you spent up front is going to save you significantly in the long run. It's going to save you $8,000 in the first five years. It's going to save you almost $20,000 in 10 years. We are looking at $30,000 in 20 years, and over the life of the loan, you will save $34,000 in money you no longer needed to give to the mortgage company as a thank you. Now, the last one, 
paying off your house faster. You can pay your house off faster by adding more money every single month. As we talked about in option number one, or option number two, your minimum monthly payment is $1,088 a month. 3.25% interest rate, you're not paying a single dime extra towards the principal of the house. You pay your home off 30 years. However, by spending that additional $5,000, you drop your interest rate down to 2.25, your minimum monthly payment is $1,007 giving you the ability to pay $81 extra every single month towards the principal of your house. That may not seem like a lot, however, you cut four years off your loan. What that does is that four years that you no longer have to spend $1,088 a month, you can now pocket over $52,000 in that same time frame. Buying points is not bad. It lowers your payment in this scenario by $88 a month. You pay $33,985 less in interest, and you can position yourself to pay your home off four years faster. And that is why buying points when refinancing is actually a very, very big positive and not a bad thing at all. Thank you very much. Have a good day.